families are still grieving in Louisiana over their teenagers who jumped into a river to save one of their friends in trouble. But not one of them could swim. Six of them drowned. African American children drown at a rate that's nearly three times that of white children. But swimming officials say it's not about race, it's about family. The problem is they don't swim because their parents don't swim. Drowning is preventable. That's true for Roxanne. She's 19 and just learned to swim. They just didn't have the time. Both parents were busy working. Her teacher? Dr. Jane Katz. She's a competitive swimmer. Go ahead. She just swam to four medals at a master's meet in Puerto Rico. Dr. Katz has dedicated her life to teaching inner city kids to swim. So, let's start our kick. Ready, leg straight. The Dr. Katz put these kids through their paces. After just one season, the lessons are paying off. I'm not advanced, but I can do much more moves than before. It's been a tremendous boost for these kids. Before, I couldn't swim at all. Now, yeah, very confident. I'm wearing a swim right now. I'm not that good. I'm wearing the basics right now. It takes a lot of courage to say, I'm going to learn, I'm going to overcome. And that confidence builds to other things in their lives. Some, like Tiger and Tenzing, are natural. I don't know what I would do without swimming. Now I can swim, so I'm yeah, very confident. She taught me how to swim. Yeah, I do love the water. It is a lifelong gift. You're never too old. It's never too late. The water is democratic. It's the great equalizer, and it works for everybody. And whether you're young, young at heart, tall, short, whatever color, whatever age, the buoyancy and magic properties of the water work for everyone.